Tigers, and welcome to Tiger Vision News for Thursday, January 14th. I'm Erin, and this is my co-host, Blissy. Thanks for joining us today. Hey, they've been working on some really neat stuff in theater. Yep, I think it's got something to do with another play. I think so, too. Let's see if we can go find out more about it. Hi, I'm Kylie. I'm here with... Evan. Brayden. Kennedy. What's new in theater? Uh, we are currently working on our one-act plays. Are there any plays coming up? Uh, yeah. The, um, the Dark Road. Okay, why'd you choose theater? Uh, because it seemed the most interesting out of all of the fine arts ones. Very entertaining and fun. Uh, well, I mean, like, I like acting. What do you like most about theater? I mean, it's just, a, but it's also, like, fun whenever we do have stuff going on. Um, I mean, I, just, I like hanging out with friends and, um... Yeah. Okay, thank you. Keep on having fun in theater. We'll be right back after this quick break. Wash your hands, wash your hands, everybody come along. Yeah. Wash your hands, wash your hands, wash your hands, everybody come along. Yeah. Wash your hands. Make sure to come to the light bar on Friday, January 15th to fill out your bracket and we can all make our predictions and smack talk to each other during all three lunches. Make sure to come. Welcome back to Tiger Vision News. Did you know that yearbooks are still for sale? Yeah, I did, but you have to get your order turned in to Miss Allison really soon. Let's go see if we can find out when yearbook orders need to be turned in. Hi, Mostin here with Camden. Osiris. When will the staff be selling yearbooks? They're on sale now at www.yearbookforever.com. How much will the yearbooks cost? 45 Where can we buy them? You can buy them online or go see Miss Allison. When will the yearbooks come in? Uh, May, around May. Thank you. Everyone, be sure to order a yearbook. They're really cool. Speaking of cool things, our Miracle Penny Drive for the Children's Miracle Network is coming up. That's right. It starts really soon. There are all sorts of plans for you to donate and help out others. We will have an interview with one of our NJHS members soon. Turning to other news, members of the FMS van have an all-region clinic and concert coming up. The event is probably going to take place virtually this year, and we know everyone in band will do their best. Now let's check in with Austin and see what the weather's like. I'm Austin with your weather today. It's uh, partly cloudy, 49 degrees, winds north, 22 miles an hour, and no precipitation. In Lubbock, we have 53 miles an hour, low 50s. Five-day forecast, low 40s, high 50s, and no barely any precipitation. That's it for weather. Back to you. Thanks, Austin. Now let's find out what's going on in sports. Hello, FMS sports fans. I'm JJ, and this is Jack, and here's a look at today's sports. The next basketball games for the boys are this afternoon. They play Heritage in what should be some pretty good games. Let's find out more about it. Hi, I'm Bliss here with... Lyle. Uh, Junior. Nicholas. How do you think the teams will do against Heritage this year? I think we'll do pretty good. Uh, good. We're going to do okay. What are you looking forward to most about the game? Uh, just having fun. Uh, playing. Yeah, playing. What position do you play? Point guard and wing. Uh, post. Post. What's the toughest thing about basketball? Uh, uh becoming a unit. Uh, playing against other teams. Keeping a good mindset. Thank you. The seventh graders play at the ninth grade center, while the eighth graders play at the Tiger Pit. The first game started at 5:30. Play hard, Tigers. That's a look at today's sports. Back to you. Well, that's all we have today. Thanks for watching Tiger Vision News. Everyone have a great afternoon. We'll see you tomorrow. Until then, Tigers. Bye. Bye.